see you this Saturday and Sunday at the San Jose Super Toy Show. Hey, what's up you guys? Shardimus Prime here doing another Star Wars action figure review on the Star Wars 6-inch Black Series Count Dooku. If you're trying to get your Star Wars figures, you can do so. Big, big, big. Get your big badass toys at BigBadToyStore.com. Click the link in the description below. And while you're down there, please be sure to hit that like button and don't forget to leave a comment and subscribe. And I've been really wanting this figure for quite some time. Count Dooku grew on me over time. At first, I didn't really like the character so much, but, you know, as time went on, you know, digging it. Anyway, on the side right here, it says Count Dooku. On the back, you can see there's an image of Count Dooku, number 107. There's a read-up over here. If you want to read it, go ahead and pause it right now. 107 again. Nothing on the top. Not much more at the bottom. So let's get to it and crack this thing open. And here's Count Dooku out of the packaging. And I gotta say, first and foremost, that head sculpt is sick, man. I'm really impressed with the head sculpt. Uh, the photo reel tech that they're using over there at Hasbro is just incredible. It has that SH Figure Arts feel to it. Uh, well, except for the plastic. You know, I mean, the plastic is definitely softer. But anyway, we got some pretty decent accessories with this guy. So let's get a closer look at those, and then we'll take a closer look at Count Dooku. So Count Dooku doesn't come with a ton of accessories, but you know what? we have here is actually quite awesome. I think the lightsaber looks fantastic. I'm so happy with the way this came out, man. Look at that. Nice sculpt. The silver paint looks great. And the black paint right there looks really good. Nice and solid. I dig it. You get a little button right down there. I believe that's where the button is. And he holds it right here. And he also has a peg where you can store it on his belt. So there's a little hole on the side right here. And you just want to do a little pegging in like that that and that holds pretty well i dig that quite a bit that's awesome then he has two different versions of his blade uh, you have just the regular red lightsaber that ports in like that that looks really good nice translucent red and then you also have the wah, 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 wah one and i think this is great as well i was actually uh looking for my six inch black series jedi knight luke skywalker effect of this and it doesn't exist. Uh, I got it confused with the hot toy. Oh my goodness. Uh, my old age. I'm going crazy. But man, I love how you get this gradient right here so that it has specific direction to where it's moving. You know, like the light is going to fade away as you're moving it this direction. So I think that is very cool. I love this accessory. Very awesome. Uh, and another accessory I wish we had was some electric effects, kind of like with Palpatine. So I was able to remove the right hand from Count Dooku right here, and you can port this in. So if you want to customize, you know, maybe change the hand color, uh, but still, or maybe take some photos like this, where, you know, you can see him facing into the camera, you know, it's pretty sweet. For some reason, I'm thinking if they wanted to include hands like this, it would have been a deluxe figure. So I don't know if everybody wants a deluxe Count Dooku. I don't know. Do you? Let me know in the comments below. Once again, I gotta say it, Hasbro did a fantastic job with this head sculpt i mean it really looks like sir christopher lee portraying count dooku over here ah, i just think they nailed it man i mean look at the details that we're seeing right here the eyes look great i love the expression on his face you know the beard looks really good that looks just amazing to me man i'm just really impressed with this i do have a tiny smudge i just noticed it right now while zooming in there's a tiny little silver smudge right there but i just noticed it now i've been enjoying the figure this whole time and just now that happened it still doesn't really bother me too much but it is there wish it wasn't there but looking at the hair i love that we get a little color variation right here you get lighter gray over the darker gray it's all slicked back it's probably how my hair is going to look when i'm older love how this face sculpt came out absolutely stunning great head sculpt and then you have the rest of the figure looking great as well i didn't realize just till now how much this reminds me of actually jedi knight luke skywalker but anyway you have the tan uh coat right over here looking really good or cape anyway i think it looks great has a pretty good spread right there so that's pretty sweet i like how the inside is lined with a different color right here nice folds and everything so really good looking cape and then he has a dark brown going throughout nice sculpted wrinkles nice soft material right over here for the bottom portion of the figure I like that. The belt looks really good. And then looking at the back, you can see the wrinkles continue on. So really great looking stuff. I do like it. And this skirt piece is made out of a soft material and everything, so it doesn't hinder articulation. You can see more of those great wrinkles sculpted in here. We have this new thing with the single jointed knee right here uh, that's hiding the pins. 
Um, I'll get into the articulation more very soon. And then you get these nice boots right there. Very militaristic looking boots. Nice wrinkles sculpted in there. And of course, he does have peg holes at the bottom of his feet. So I like the articulation on Count Dooku, but you're going to hear me gripe. I got gripes. Uh, first off, there's no neck hinge right here. It looks like a dumbbell kind of thing going on. So you can kind of move the head upwards that much and down just that much. You also get a neck joint right there. So that does help a little bit. So with both of those joints moving together, though, it still only moves upward that far. So uh, it can move down that far. You get side to side motion, good neck and head pivoting right there. We have the beautiful butterfly joints on the inside. So I love that. You can shift that forward and back and not really up and down so much, just a little bit in and out, but you get more shoulder uh, joint movement outward like that at the shoulder. And then you can move it down all the way full 360 single jointed elbow that does bend in more than 90 degrees i do prefer double jointed elbows though on the left side you get a wrist that swivel side to side hinges up and down on the right side it has a horizontal hinge you do have a waist joint that turns side to side waist pivot moves forward a little bit and back and then you get hips that move outward that far you will kick forward that far and back uh, you get an upper thigh cut right here an interesting single jointed knee i'm not used to seeing this from you know the hasbro six inch black series but yeah uh, kind of looks all right sometimes it doesn't look okay but it does bend in pretty far you could also rotate right there ankles move down they move up and he has beautiful ankle pivot and to measure out this count dooku figure you could see that he is standing just a little over six and a half inches tall and then here's count dooku next to the first release versions of anakin skywalker and yoda and then here's count dooku next to the deluxe general grievous figure and man oh, i still love this figure as tricky as he is to stand Love this Grievous. Then here's Count Dooku next to the second release Jedi Knight Luke Skywalker from the 6 inch black series. And yeah, he's very tall over here compared to Luke Skywalker. But yeah, Mark Hamill is pretty short. And then for your Sith comparison, we have Count Dooku next to Darth Maul, Darth Vader, Darth Sidious, and Snoke. Uh, it's just like one just doesn't go with the others right over here, right? It's kind of funny. But yeah, I, I don't know what the difference is between a Count and a Darth. Uh, someone tell me. Because yeah, but, but why isn't he Darth Dooku? Okay, I know why. That sounds awful darth dooku <laughs> and then here's count dooku next to your average six inch scale figure we have the marvel legends big time badass spider-man oh all the jedi don't let me play with their lightsabers can i see yours huh oh thank you sweet whoa <laughs> oh, 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 oh. So again, I really do like this figure a lot. We're getting a fantastic head sculpt. I like the cloth cape. The accessories over here are great. You know, I like the articulation while I still have gripes with it. Still really like it a lot, man. And I'd like to know what you guys think. So please leave a comment down below. Hit the like button and hit that subscribe button as well as the notification bell. And a big thank you to all these people over here that support this YouTube channel over on the Patreon. If you're interested in the giveaways and the exclusive content, I post daily over there. So if you want to see it, check it out. Link in the description below. And this figure once again man is a dope piece you need to have it if you're a big fan of the star wars prequels or the clone wars cartoons you know what i mean so it's an essential figure and i think they did a really good job making this and at the price point of around 20 to 25 bucks i'm giving this a sub rating of i love it and don't forget to let me know what you think in the comment section below if you want to follow me on the social media you can find me on instagram twitter and twitch links to all that stuff in the description below and i'll catch you guys later peace <laughs> Action figures, I'm posing action figures, I'm posing action figures every day. I'm posing action figures, I'm posing action figures, I'm posing action figures, it's okay. That's crispy. Hey, new Sharpness Prime videos. Hey, you should click one. Yeah, click on one of them. Or subscribe if you haven't.